This is a summer special delicacy from Bengali Kitchen. So let's go directly to the cooking the ingredients first here. Here I have taken few vegetables. Uh, and first of all, I have fried the fish with little bit of salt and turmeric powder. Norum kore bhajben matsta. And here are the vegetables. That is, uh, I have taken radish. I have taken uh, collapses. That is, uh, gathi kochu, uh, three pieces of mango, and uh, some okra or bhindi. Here, the spices will be very minimum. That is, turmeric powder, salt according to your taste, and paach foron. and um, apart from that the tempering i have taken two dry red chilies and um, well some mustard oil also is there well i'll give all the details of the ingredients in my description box please check that now here heat a pan and um, when it is heated add some mustard oil to it say just only 1 teaspoon full of mustard oil is more than enough a ranna tai tel bishon bishon kam lage only for the tempering the oil is required and it's a typical summer special bengali recipe hello friends this is indrani cooks where i make cooking easy and fun filled so let us start our journey now see friends here at the tempering will be of paach foron but what i see is a little bit of uh, more or fennel seeds will do better with the paach foron so i will be adding fennel seeds extra half a teaspoon full of paach foron and 1/4 teaspoon full of fennel seeds i will be adding and if your paach foron contains a lot of fennel seeds then you can ignore this step also now when the uh, tempering is nicely done to this i will be adding uh, two dry red chilies and let the aroma be released and after that i will be adding the vegetables one after the other first of course i will be adding the raw mango uh, that is three pieces of raw mango i have added then goes the gathi kochu or the arbi and then goes uh, the radish uh, muli and comes the mixing i have not added the bhindi or okra or the lady's finger now first i will be frying these vegetables this hard vegetables and uh, just uh, 30 seconds frying friends friends if you all like my recipe please don't forget to smash the like button share with your friends as much as possible and those who are new to my channel my humble request please consider subscribing along with the small bell icon next to it so that you get all the notification as soon as i upload my videos now here goes a little bit of haldi or turmeric powder and salt according to your taste now mix everything together very nicely again now this dish has very little ingredients you are seeing friends the spices are minimal uh, almost no spice only turmeric and salt but try this once this is very wonderful perfect dish for the summer delicacies you see in the summer afternoon lunch you can have your steamed rice with this once do try it now i am going to add the bhindi or the okra to it and just i will be mixing for 30 to 40 seconds not more than that and after that i will be adding water to it i'll show you all friends add the water uh, here i have added 1 and 1/2 cup of water you add the water according to your choice your gravy the sauce how much you want to keep the uh, gravy or the soup you add water that much and the vegetables has to be boiled very nicely shobji gulo somosto sheddho hoye jabe ar jhol joto ta apnara chaichen toto ta jhol thakbe to shei moton jol deben ami ekhane der cup er moto jol diyechi apnara apnader icche moton jol ta deben now cover this and let this boil once it is boiled then i will be lowering the flame now this will be on the high flame and when it starts boiling i will be lowering the flame to the lowest point and i will be keep it till the vegetables are soft i will show you all that friends this was for 10 minutes after 10 minutes i'll show you all friends see so nicely it has been prepared and uh, i feel so cool cool thanda thanda after seeing this all my vegetables are very very nicely softened now to this i will be adding the fried fish um the fish also as i told you all i have fried with a little bit of turmeric powder and salt all bengalis know how to fry the fish and what is added to the fish uh, now add this and uh, let this be uh, left alone for 10 minutes 
as the standing time do not boil this after adding the fish just do not boil this mix it very nicely and then cover it and keep it if you keep on boiling the fish for uh, um, for a long time what will happen there will be a fishy smell which i don't like and always i add the fish to the uh, jhol or to the gravy when everything is cooked i do not boil the fish along with the vegetables in the gravy it gives a, a stinky smell which i don't like after adding the fish um put the gas stove off and 10 to uh, 15 minutes standing time is essential now it is ready to serve friends see i have served it and i have showed you all do enjoy this and let me know how was your experience with the, this dish be happy be merry catch you all soon again thanks for watching.